to my lifetime. I know it's been a while, huh, guys, and ladies and gents and all that. All my lovelies in between. It's been a long while, has it not? Sorry, I'm trying to fix the lighting. But yes, my darlings, it's been a long time since I've done a live. And hi, Susan. I'm actually excited to be doing this live because I just, I don't know, it's been a while. <laughs> but let me get myself situated. So I got a couple of new things. Hi, Jody. <laughs> How's it going? Um, I've been, I've missed you too, Susan. Um, I'm doing well. Um, it's, I'm telling you, working in the school system this year has been really hard. So I had to like separate myself a bit from the whole other part of my life, I guess. Um, just put focus into family and uh, work, try and find a balance. And unfortunately, doing videos was one of those things that was not in the same, it didn't help with the balance. Um, Jody said, same, I look all the time to see if I missed the video. Oh, you really haven't missed much. <laughs> um, I knew I needed to do a live because I miss doing lives. I miss talking to you. Joe said, and going, you are all good. Yes, I'm doing fine. Summer lessons are starting next week, so I've been having to get on top of my game for that. Partly why I'm doing an A5. Now, I've been I've been working in my, like, pocket. This thing has been <laughs> so helpful. And as you can tell, it's super used. Um, I've been enjoying this, but I needed to pair it with something larger to have at home. Uh, I think my daily... And my normal planning will stay in here, but in my scheduling for on the go, I've got a lot of notes and stuff. Um, but I wanted something a little larger. Hey guys. You want to say hey to everybody? Hello. <laughs> Papa Kitty, say hello. But Papa Kitty spoiled me today. Look what he got me. I know these are very popular right now, but I've been wanting to try them. So I got the box of 24. And I'm super excited to test these out with you guys. Diana said, oh, hell yeah, live time, Mr. Queen, how you been? Hey, girl, hey, I've been doing good. I hope you've been doing well. That excites me that you're excited. Excited. That you're excited. Uh, Susan said, hi, Papa Kitty. He said, hello. I feel like I need to pour some wine for this. This, Yeah. <laughs> um. So, yeah, uh, how's everybody else been going? I'm so sorry that I've missed you guys. I've missed you so much. Uh, it's so nice to be able to talk to you again. <laughs> uh, so, you guys want to see what my plans are? Because I'm kind of, like, not entirely too sure. I <laughs> Punching inserts for A5 is not my strong suit, and I've done it very poorly. <laughs> Susan says, yes. Um, I will admit, this has been, like, my go-to look how chunky it is and i didn't want to wait until this weekend to share my new planner that was coming um but it hadn't gotten here so i figured i'd go ahead and set up my a5 i will say that i got this pen today this intergel um needle tip i love this pen i think this is going to be my new favorite pen um i got some friction pens for scheduling for work um because this just wasn't cutting it and then I got this one to sign my papers with because this is a um, permanent gel ink. And then I've got some multiple frictions and stuff like that. And then, of course, I said I we're going to swatch this today, so I'm excited about that. Okay, so I need to show you all something. I've, as, I've got the vintage pink um, A5, but I was going to move into that. But what I reckon, realized was that... Um, these rings are much smaller than the ones in the newer A5s, like the older versions have, I think, like 25 or 23 mil. I think even 23 millimeter rings. These, and then the newer ones have the 30, so I'm going to need the 30 probably, so I will not be moving into the vintage pink like I wanted. I don't know if you can tell the difference, but it's much more small. I'm trying to get it to where you can kind of see. Do you see the difference there? Look how much smaller that is. I literally think this is like 23. It's the same as my 
pocket Jillia was. So I'm going to stick with the purple for now because I need the size and I also um, it's my oldest one and I don't mind it getting beaten up. So all right. So the first thing I need to put in is the back like the page lifter. So I'm just kind of made one from the from a set from Michaels from years ago um, from this guy so this is what I'm using um, it depends on if I want to use the gold side or the silver side I think I'm going to stick silver on the outside okay there's that so that's the back um, let me show you what I've got going on here so I printed out these I've, I purchased these a when I was in my B6 at the beginning of the year and I, per I printed them out to go in here and this is like an, um, an A5 size. I just, it was a full sheet and then I just lowered the percentage to I think about 80 or 85. So I've got the whole year. Now, I love that it's purple. I mean, that goes with this. So I was thinking of putting this in the front, but I'm not sure. I also don't want to punch holes in it. So I do have... Hold on. I do have this these pockets in here. Let's take this stuff out. This is all old stuff. I need to have this guy in there because this is um, important for the summer to show I don't want to take any pictures of my daughter to the pool because they will get messed up so we're going to take those out so I do have a couple of folders but they're so much larger than the inserts themselves so it needs to go in the back but I don't really like the idea of it being in the back because I would like this in the front so I've got you know things to work out with like y'all gonna help me yes you are Okay, so I've also got these side dividers. I can change. Um, these are just stickers. I can peel those off. But I also have the monthly dividers. Now, I actually have the guts of my main planning in here. Um, I'll be using my Summer's Touch mm, I guess she called these Mon Weeklies? No. I forgot, but the, oh, Fox and Nietzsche. They're like Hobonichi spread. Um, I really like those. They work well, and I can actually put my um, schedule in there as well, and I'll show you that in a minute. So this is going to be the main. I do have an inbox set up already that was already in here. This is my inbox. It's basically, I finally got a laminator, by the way, you guys. So basically just laminated a random, just, just laminate. And then I've got a place to put sticky notes. And then I forgot where I got these, um, awesome inserts from like uh, printables, but there was like a set of them. So I need to cut these out, but there was an inbox one and I just put it there. These are the parts of my inbox. I have like a to do, a to buy, um, I think that's to do. Uh, to buy pro for projects and then I have a someday maybe and then a waiting on you know the basic inbox stuff and that's with the purple paper so that's my inbox and I'd like to make it kind of cute um, let me show you all okay before I show you the pretty stuff so I, I'm gonna have that and I know it's gonna go in the front as always okay um, I've got my like lit notes I guess or lists I'm not sure how to say that. Um, these are just the reference, I guess. So I used to have these in the front, but I think I'm going to stick them in the back. Um, they're just colored Filofax pages with just, um, I guess, I don't know how to, weekly focus, monthly checklist, routines, healing crystals, like notes. It's literally reference. So that's going to go in the back along with find it okay these here um, is it's private information it's like contacts uh, reference uh, contacts and passwords and stuff like that so that's gonna go with this and it's probably gonna go behind here 
So let me stick that there. I'm going to keep it clipped for the most part right now, just for right now, so I can figure out what kind of pretty stuff I want to put between. And then, so that's going to go in the back. I look when I say I'm the worst at punching with a5 y'all I can't I can't do it I need an a5 punch but yeah we're just gonna ignore the fact that it looks hideous and it's gonna go with my daily pages so I have there's a few ways I like to do dailies a lot of the time in the larger planners I like to be more um, like bullet journal like I don't I can't explain it I like a more free style freehand style I guess so I'll use either this chunk of <laughs> note pages or like line page pages or I will go ahead I did print out and fairly did well punching the my summer's touch dailies I do like these as well so I'm gonna have a variety of daily pages and they're all different sizes like I can't this is why I don't like printing and cutting my own stuff I'll do it because it's cheaper but at the same time I just want to like I want it to be nice it needs to look nice and this is does not look nice so um I may can just trim down my <laughs> today pages they're a little bigger than the these guys I don't know so these the setup of how I want to do things is what's going to be difficult because um, I do have a leftover how I used to work my A5 is that I would have one of these guys from my Summer's Touch and I would use the grid in between like this for my dailies. But I don't want to do that this time so we're going to take these out and move them that way. But I did have a monthly that I liked using to pull out like this. You can see how bad I like punch these suckers. So oh, so bad. Um, which basically you have all this stuff that you can track. Um, it's also from my summer's touch. It's a monthly plan, so I can do that. And I the reason why I don't do it front and back is because I've gotten to where I would like to have my month all together. That's why I have monthly tabs, but the way these, sorry, y'all, I've been calling slimmer, so we're going to have a lot of that happening. The way the folks in Nietzsche uh, inserts work, they're back to back. So like having it separate is going to be a little, I think, more complicated. So I don't know. I don't even know if I want to use all this because I'm using my pocket planner too. And a lot of my like um, health tracking, I really like the health tracker that's in here. I just want to stick with that. I don't want to make it too complicated. So I have another option. I can just knock this out because I feel like if I do too much in my planner, I wouldn't actually use it as well. Um, I do have this pull out too. I used to love using this for like sleep, but like I said, I have that health tracker. I should ask her for an A5 size, but maybe put those aside. I'm not sure yet. Um, let's see. I could just put, you know, one of these. I could just go ahead and suck it up and punch one of these suckers in here and use that as my monthly. I may just do that because I do have small cards too. Like, show you, like this, like this. I could stick one of those in the front. I don't know. What do you guys think? I really need simple inserts. I like simplicity, so let me go ahead and stick. I do want to have a. Ooh, I can't show you all that. I need a backing to that. Let's see. How are we gonna do this? I haven't even figured like the theme really let me show you my pretty stuff and maybe you guys can help me figure out what kind of theme I need I'm gonna go ahead and stick this stuff in here I need a backing for this we're gonna use this as a backing I like the simple color so Okay, 
Um, so I need to decide if I really want to use these monthly tabs or just the simple tabs. Um, because I kind of was using both. I had ended up using both because I need to take off these stickers. I don't know if I can get them off very well. Downside to fake nails. Hard to get stuff off, believe it or not. I don't know how well I can get this off, y'all. Anyway, so let's just stick this here for now. Um, oh yeah, pretty stuff. Let me show y'all pretty stuff. I'm kind of all over the place. Y'all forgive me. Please forgive me. Um, yeah, that's my inbox. Okay, like I said, I have these. There's my dailies. I do have a future appointment. I'm, I'm debating, I think, for my monthly, I may just draw it out because I do like doing that. Um, that has to go in. Here's the, um, okay. I have this guy, and I have this, and I have some other stuff I can print out too. And there was a one I used, I think I put her in here, that I cut her down. I think. Oh no, I must have taken her out. I do with her. I did something with her. But I had one, a doll cut out that looked really good with this this overlap. So I may print her out again. But I also have these. If y'all recall, I um, put these in my A6. These are actually I the right size, the A5 size. Um, these were meant for A5. I ended up uh shrinking them for my A6, but I decided to print this out on vellum and use that. I think, like, obviously this one's my most favorite. <laughs> so, I have those. It's neutrals, you know, whatevs. I love a good neutral moment. This, from last time, this was digital declutter, like, I will ever do that, but <laughs> I also have two folders that are really large, and then the cloth and paper. I got two of these, believe it or not. Two of these cloth and paper cards. So I could always do what uh, everyone's doing right now and make my routine cards. I actually want to do that. So I have some already laminated laminate. <laughs> and this just happens to be close to perfect size. So that's something we'll do. Let's make some routine cards. That could be the front of my planner. You know, options, y'all. Just options. And I do, in my A6, I don't remember if y'all remember this. In my A6, I also have um, these covers. I need to, I would like to print these out for A5 too. Um, I think that would be fun. You know, my A6 was so perfect. I don't know why I switched out of it. Just the size, I guess, was a little weird. See, here's, here's these. See how pretty that is over the... So, let's just get the main setup for right now. And then we'll go from there. What do you ladies and gents think? I really do like this purple. But it's different for each month. Like... Like next month is green, neutrals, pinks, you know. So. All right. Um, so this is my, maybe I should make a cover. This is going to be reference. Okay. This is going to be reference. I need to make, get this off. <laughs> this is not the fun part. There we go. I'll probably make a new tab too. Alright, so reference. And I believe under there. I mean, I do want to put this. This is reference. So that can go there. And then the blue throws me off for whatever reason. So 
So I do have this um, that I can cut down. Why not? Why not? Sure, why not? If you guys have any suggestions, let your girl know. Oh, I actually love that over that. Ooh, ooh. Oh, snap. Y'all, this pen is everything. If you haven't gotten this pen, oof, I like it. So, recently, besides the fact that school was taken out of me, my grandmother fell, broke her hip, and her wrist, so that was one thing that really got to me. Another thing that happened is that, you know, did I tell you about the kittens outside? We ended up with really cute kittens that we've been taking care of outside. A traumatizing event happened for me. Um, one morning, the kitten got under in my car wheel and uh, I didn't know and it died and I watched it happen and that was super traumatizing I'm still not even over that like it was my favorite one too so I feel like such an animal killer um so that and all this ha keep in mind all this happened within one week all this stuff and then our indoor cat got into, I, I pick herbs and like hang them. My cat got into parsley <laughs> and he's okay, but he started doing that whole foaming at the mouth thing to try and get, you know, the poison out. Oh, I was like, I'm just killing off animals left and right. It was, I've had quite a traumatizing one to you guys. And then just, just the drama. <laughs> so crazy. All right, so when it comes to punching, I have this guy that does do A5, but it doesn't actually sit right. And I did figure it out at one time, but I got out of A5 as soon as I figured it out. So now I'm just like, oh, I hate this so much. But anyway, <laughs> we're going to try again since this is the same size. We're going to just, I like totally ghetto rig everything, you guys. Okay draw the circle in there and I don't have a handheld puncher or I would do that I mean I do but it's a heart shape and quite frankly it doesn't hold up um, the the holes don't hold up as well as a circle shape they tear a lot more easily so I kind of just don't even worry about it what I need to do I end up with junk everywhere I mean, this does have an A5, like, thing, but it never runs, sits right. I moved. So it's crooked. I need to do it flat. I think I figured it out all of a sudden. That's great. I did, I did it okay that'll do let me repunch this side because honestly it's just crooked okay there we go so let's do this positivity Ooh, that looks so nice there you go bam that looks good right right I may have to print some more stuff out like for covers and everything what are you girls up oh, let me see what y'all are doing Oh no, love the eyes, yeah. Yes, it is smaller. Yeah. So good to talk to you. I'm so glad to be doing this. I should have been doing this a long time ago. I should have gotten on here a lot, you know, just to chit chat because you guys make me feel better all the time. Okay, so what I have left, I have a project section. I usually like to draw out like my projects and stuff. And here's... <laughs> Here's proof of that. Um, I do that in any planner I'm using, really, except for the pocket planner. I'm not really doing that too much. So that's what I want for this guy. I really do want to do the covers. I'm going to have to go onto my computer and see if I can't figure that out. If I, Or I may have to purchase an A5 size of it. But I felt when I purchased it that it came in all the sizes. So I'll have to double check. 
Um, so yeah, I do need a project section. Now I need to figure out oh geez, how I'm going to set up my main planning in here because I like to have it all together. What did I do? I'm so chaotic when I do stuff like this. This once was my family section, but it's not now. So let's just take this sticker off. I would really like to, I need to get some more um, tape for my label maker with like different foilers. Foil is <laughs> different foils. I think that would be fun. Um, okay, so we need a. Let's do. I want again a solid kind of sheet. I should print out. I almost wanted to make this cat themed, and I have all the stuff for the cat themed stuff, but I'm just I'm not going to. Um, let me just get this stuff in place first. I think I'm gonna put this one in the bag. Hi, Diana. Hi, Diana. Welcome. Uh, sure. Yeah, I'm definitely going to do those covers, y'all. I want to figure out what I want to do on the front side. Okay. Um, okay, so here's the deal. I definitely... I think I'm just going to draw out my monthly. I'm not even sure. I may print out my beast. Actually, hold on. Let me show you something. Let's see if this will work. We'll figure this out together. Oh, I've been having back issues, so you're going to have to hear me go ooh, a lot. Is this an A5? Uh, I think I have some A5 stuff printed. Hang on. Yeah, I sure do, y'all. I have some A5 stuff. Damn. <sighs> it's like an old lady. My old lady. Okay, I do. Where's this A6? This is A6. Never mind. Hold up. But I do have... I do have these B6 size uh, calendars, and I think I can maybe make them work for A5. What do you guys think? I can even make them as a fold-out, but I don't really want to do that. I did not print them front and back, which is what I wanted, so that works. That's some kind of really paper. Oh, is this like where I messed up? Oh yeah, these are my messed up sheets. Besides these two. But I only need them for the next couple months. So, let's do that. Look, using what you have, people. Use what you have. Um, I really do love these inserts. This is what I use for my B6 Stology. <laughs> but I like to put it onto my rib paper. And this isn't. This is on my heavy paper. So, let's use these. Let me go ahead and stick in, um, I am going to use my monthlies as well because I, uh, I think I like to separate things like that. But, okay, hang on. And I do have this full year too in these particular inserts, or at least most of the year. And then I'll show you what I've been doing for this month so far. I got all this private information, like, from the pool covered up, so you can kind of see what I'm doing in a minute. Um, I've even liked the idea of me drawing out my own weeks. I like that look as well. Just me just swinging it. I dig it. Okay, there's June. Okay. And then 
All right, so this is the inbox to go in the front. All right, so I need to decide how I want to do this, okay? I like future appointments is going to go in front of it all, so all right. Right here. Come on now. There. And then I need to cut this down. And I also have dailies that I could use. Now, I have to... Okay, focus. Let's do this first. Let's cut down this to fit. Um... Let me see. I need to decide how much of this I want to cut off. Do I want to cut off the bottom or the top? We can keep the top on there for the most part. Let's cut the bottom. Okay, let me cut off the bottom first. probably wondering why I don't just buy a uh, monthly um because I'm kind of broke <laughs> my husband treats me to stuff but me personally I'm not gonna ask him to buy me stuff because you know he needs to want like I'm just I'm not okay with that um okay is this smaller than this no okay this is good to use as a Ooh, okay, so this will cut right there on the edge. But that's all right. Now let's do it. Let's see if this will even work. If not, I have another way I can make it work. <laughs> glue it in. Yeah, this won't work because I'm going to want to punch it in here and then punch it here. So I'm going to have to glue this on another thing. Let's see what we can make shift. Can make shift this shit. I should have like a, um, oh yeah, I could totally do that. I could do like a, what you call it? A, a title page? Yeah. Yeah. And put it on a normal piece of paper. Um, I could just stick it on a, be cheap and just stick it on a, do I have a blank file fax page? I know I do. Yes, I do. Da, da, da. There it is. Got a couple of them, so. So I could actually cut this down some. Do it like this or not, it doesn't matter. Yeah, look, I could just, yep, we're doing it. <laughs> I'm so ghetto. Anyone else do this? They just like use what they have and try and make things work because that's literally what I'm doing right now. <laughs> I mean, that's what I used to do before I had like, access to online stuff I used to take the time and pretty much collage together my pages <laughs> because I didn't have any way to I guess purchase stuff and then um, I would use like post-it notes and like note cards and stuff like that to create my pages does that make sense I used to do that all the time Don't worry, if I decide to do something different, I'll let y'all know. <laughs> I may be like, okay, this is super unprofessional looking. But. I need to look into my computer and see what I can play around with. Just put a flat cap, there you go. Is it in there? Okay. 
Does it work? <laughs> Did it actually work? No! Mm. So annoying. Whatever. Okay. At least that fits better. And then I can honestly just make like this ugly stuff I can just cover up with washi tape or whatever I feel like doing. So there's a monthly. So this will be the cover page. And what I can do, I have to decide if I want to do this, is stick this here. I'm going to have to cut it down a little more though because it's exactly like the width of A5. Um, so I don't think I want to do that, but I do have... see what y'all are saying maybe y'all can help me out no this is not my new cloud planner um i hadn't told everybody i was getting a cloud yet but i guess now is a good time i'm getting a cloud planner but it's pocket size um i'm getting a pocket size cloud planner because i just couldn't resist it was so cute looking and i think it would be perfect as a wallet slash planner for on the go and i'm just waiting for it to get here this is my malden um, and if I like it, I mean, I'm a leather person, like I love leather. So it's kind of weird for me to look for something that's non-leather, but I just, I couldn't help it. It was just too cute, too, too cute. So let's see. I'm going to put, this is going to be my title page for, I guess, June. That would make sense. Let's do it that way. June. And then I could definitely maybe hand letter or something like that. I'm really bad at that, but, um, June in there. Okay. So the next thing I need to figure out if I got my monthly cool, and then I could put my goals here. Maybe I'm kind of doing like a bullet style, not necessarily all everything printed out perfectly. I just, yeah. Or I can put my dailies here and then I've got my weekly here which is weird for me it's a little backwards than what I normally do but I think that could work I like the idea of having my dailies so just written within the column but the way I draw my columns is a little bit wider than what I have printed and then during these what I have covered up with the yellow post-it is actually private information it's my swim lesson time so I guess I could just stick with this for daily and then um, see what happens from there. But what I'm going to do is actually, see I already started putting dailies in the front. So I'm going to just go ahead and put a couple of dailies there. Question is, do I just want to use line paper or do I want to actually use the dailies I print out? What do I want to do? I decide I don't think I want to use this stuff right here. It's just too, too much work. Um, I've already printed these out. Why not? I mean, they are smaller than the actual pages, which is interesting. How that worked out. Um, I honestly just love just normal paper. Okay. I don't know. Uh, I think I'm just going to put I'm just going to put a couple of days there. Because I like my dailies with my weeklies. I even thought about you guys doing like a Dutch door thing in between. And I did try it, and these are small enough to kind of do it. I could probably still see the dates at the top, especially if I punched it down here. 
I could do it that way, but I like seeing my week as a whole. What do you guys suggest? Because I want to keep these weeklies. And maybe it'll just put my daily stuff on these pages. So I'm just going to stick some of these somewhere else. When I do have these, I can just stick like <laughs> so poorly, like <laughs> they are so poorly punched. They look like crazy a crazy person punched these. Well, I guess in a way they did. I am a little bit crazy. I don't know. Let's just think on that. Okay, so I'll have a cover page here. And then there's future appointments. And then... This isn't even filling up like I thought it would. Let's see. Uh, and then get the stickers off. I'm going to be playing with this planner all night, I think. Look, my daughter's on vacation with her grandparents, so... And I don't have anything to do tomorrow because I did everything today, so... I can stay up as late as I want. Come on now. Ooh. Yeah. Alright. I'm definitely going to make covers. Uh cover pages because I like those. I love a good cover page. Okay, and then I may, what I could do is put my dailies extremely separate um, or whatever uh, because I do my day, I actually write my dailies in here, but what I'm finding with dailies in here is like I use a really small box and it works just fine, see, because I really don't have that much to do, but um Sometimes I want more room, so, whoa, can't show you that stuff. Um, I actually have this little notebook in the back, too, and it's worked very well for me. But let's see. Okay, let me go ahead and put my inbox in. Now, do I truly need... I may not need all these dividers, either. box which I will be using this one and then this is the other one actually that may work hold on this says today so, I think what I'm going to do, eh. alright, I'm going to actually pull out all the cream colored pages and then I'm probably going to purchase some cream colored. I love Filofax pa paper. I don't know why. I like the thinness of it. I actually can use my fountain pen as well on file effects paper so I don't know if anybody else knew that but my Lamy ink does well on it pull out all this cream colored stuff okay see I have some blank ones which will be good for cover pages good, that's all blank I like using the graph in my project section so I'm going to turn that over there and I like using this blank for projects so there. Use that for cover pages, like I mentioned a bajillion times. So, just until I can purchase the ones I want or print the ones I want. Okay. And then projects. 
Cover page. And then graph and Um, okay, I know this is probably kind of uh, boring for some of you, but I love doing this stuff. And also, we're about to stop and do a swatch test. I do have swatch tests in this planner. Um, I don't normally have swatch tests in many planners, but this one I do. Which I think I enjoy. So, um, and I'm actually going to turn this into a cover page. Hey, Steph, how's it going, boo? It's been a while. Okay, so let's take a break from setting this up and do a little swatchy poo. What do you say? What do you guys say? You know, down for Colors of the World swatches. Now, this is a cream colored paper, so um, it's going to be a little different, but that's a okay with me. All right. So hubby got me this today and I'm just couldn't be excited. And they actually have like a miniature swatch on the side. I thought that was cute. Um, these probably will not stay in their box. I like to set my pins up a certain way. So they're probably going to come out and be set up a certain way, but, um, in a like stand. But let me see if I can get this without breaking it. I don't want the color to come off. I'm going to keep the swatch panel there. Yeah. There we go. Because it doesn't open up like this. It opens from the side. Isn't that interesting? Look. Look at that. Ta-da! That's how it opens into these three different boxes. And then you've got the swatches on both sides. You've got the crayons. All right. Oh, and whose birthday is it? Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Steffi. Happy birthday to you. Here you go. I just put those scissors. Ow, ow, ow. Let me move all of this paper. So I do have a ton of this. I love the colored paper. I think I like I like this peach tone. Or orange, I guess you could say. It's so pretty. Let me put this to the side for now. Okay. Mm. So what I'm going to do is cut these out. I guess I don't even have to swatch them, but I'm going to because they react differently on paper. So I love that they come in different boxes. I wonder what, if that's I definitely, and look, the boxes it looks like you can color them too. Okay, so this is like the light skinned <laughs> version. So, let's start with this. Yeah, I think this is like the light skin version and then medium skin. Yeah, medium. And then the darker skin. Oh no, I don't know. The okay, so brown tones. Ooh, I love this box. <laughs> Alright, let's start. Alright, so these are gonna be your peachy, pinky tones, see? I guess. Ooh yeah, baby. Looking good. I don't want to mess these up, so I'm gonna. This is very light rose. I feel like I need to use a white paper. How many of these do I have? Oh well, let's just let's just go for it. Wow, that's very light. I love it though. That's super pretty. Uh, you can barely tell. Let me bring y'all in. 
I don't think you're going to be able to tell. But yeah, there it is. And then that is the... Very light rose. Okay. Then you have extra deep rose. I mean, I'm just taking them out of the box as is um, and doing it that way. So, extra deep rose. Okay, I like that. That's pretty. This is pretty much the color of the paper. This is extra light almond. It's probably the color of my skin. Yeah, it's literally almost the same color as this paper. <laughs> and then... This is light rose. That's pretty. You okay, Pop? Your voice is coming from over there. Okay. This one is very deep rose. So we have extra deep very deep interesting okay <laughs> i'm intrigued by this the range of this medium deep rose so i guess these are all the rose colors oh i like that one too Okay. Ooh, this one's pretty. Deep Rose. Ooh, that's pretty. I like that. It, you really can't tell on the camera, I don't think. But it's pretty. It's definitely a rose color. I guess, uh, literally, I think that's what this whole box is, is like rose colors. Low yeah, this is light medium rose right here. Ooh, that's pretty too. I bet they're making bank off of this line. I love this line. So pretty. Alright, so that was the first box. I guess that's a rose box, huh? Um, let's see what this is gonna be. These are gonna be more medium tones, I guess. So this is going to be medium deep golden. So I guess golden tones. Oh yeah. This is Deepest Almond. Woo! It's pretty. And I'm writing on top of them to see how my pen looks with it. Because if that's the case, I could use it as like a highlighter. And this must be almond. Very light golden. Okay. That's very light. Um, the extra light almond, this one is the exact color as the paper. This is a little darker than the paper. Let's 
see. Very light golden. Next one, we have Deep Golden. Ooh, fresh marker. I love it. Oh, yeah. If you're looking for very satisfying swatches, I'm sorry I'm not the one. Like, I have really bad handwriting. And when on camera, it's just, it's already difficult to film. Um, and write properly so this one by the way is light medium golden I like this color a lot okay Three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, next one is another dark one. Darker color. This is a extra deep golden. Like I said, this is a golden. <laughs> golden round, I guess. Hold on. Just know. That has a green hue to it. Do you see that? And then it changes as it dries. Interesting. Extra deep golden. And then we have... This is a beautiful color too. Light golden. So I guess you have a very light, a light, a medium, a dark, a medium dark, and dark in all the boxes. So that's interesting. And last but not least, of course, is medium golden. <laughs> so, yeah. That one's pretty, too. Oops. By the way, this pen is everything. I'm really loving it. <laughs> okay, so there's that. And after I swatch these, then we'll move on. I'll be making task cards and everything. All right, so next we're going to have this box. It's in the yellow box. So let's see what happens. We have medium deep almond. Very pretty. Then we have very light almond. See, there's the extra light almond right here. It's very light almond. I feel like I should put them all like together, like extra light, very light almond, medium deep. That's all golden. Almond. I feel like I need to do that so you can see the change in the color. I'm losing people. Ooh, that's, that's pretty. Not pretty. I really love the deepest almond color. That's really nice. This one is extra deep almond. Uh, we have another light one. This one is going to be light almond. Yay, Steph! Thank you. Um, it seems like the more layers you put, though, the darker it'll get. So keep that in mind. Light almond. Then you have another dark color. This one's going to be very deep almond so you have extra deep almond and then this one's 
very deep almond. And then you have like the deepest almond. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. I'm trying to think. And then you have another light color. This one is light medium almond. I'm telling you, they're just kind of. So you got a golden, an almond, and a rose line here. <laughs> I think I'm going to make a swatch where, like I just mentioned, make it where. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm going to make it where it all lines up nicely. Oh. That's the deep almond. <laughs> I'm going to want the white pen back because this is awesome. Yeah, right. <laughs> I loved it. I like it better than that other one. So, this one, oh, I love this color. This one is medium almond. All right. There you have it. And then I'm going to hand letter colors of the world there, but right now let's move on. 24 colors. Love it. They all come in their own little individual boxes. Isn't that cute? Thank I don't like the black one too much. I like it, but I prefer the white. You need to try it though, for real. So I'm just going to move that aside for now, and we'll play with that later. But that was fun, right? Okay, moving on. Back to the seriousness-ness-ness. Back to the seriousness. Okay, so I actually skipped the... I have two tabs down here, and then I skipped the ones in the middle because I have all the... All these guys. All these guys. I have all the um, monthly tabs there. Kind of wish I got them in a different color. Not clear. That's okay. I'm trying to... Oh, let me pull y'all back out. I forgot y'all were so close in. Woo! There we go. Alright. Susan's still here. You're always here, Susan. Always know you're there for me. I love it. I'm going to have to take some more medicine for my back. Let's see. I'm trying, y'all. trying. Shouldn't have had nails on. This is annoying. I definitely don't want to mess up my divider, so forget that for now. That's taking too long. Okay. Okay. Let me put a... Cover of that. Um... Hold on. Here we go again. Stinking this. I think these stickers came from like a tab set that I had from Planner Press. These things are hard to get off. I'll work on that later. All right. So, stop. Okay. So, what's going on here? These are all the. Notes from where I've been. Okay. Now. Dun, 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 dun. I do have these two pouches that I like to keep on me. I prefer this than this one. This one's kind of like a floppy. So I may just do one. Um, one of which I need to put. Well, in this pouch, I need to put um, my certification so people can see it. So that's going to go in the back. Boom. And the other, I'll probably trim that down. Let me trim that down real quick. Ooh. 
got it folded. I don't know why. I guess to make it thicker. But let me just cut this down all the way. So that will go and I guess my calendar will too so that makes me I have to decide if this is going to end up being my front or not because I truly love having a pretty front um, that's just something that I've always done and prefer right so I like the idea of having the calendar in the front now let me show you what I'm talking about though like I don't think I will though. See how far this pokes out? You see that? That's the only thing I don't like about that. So I think I'm just gonna stick. I have like the whole month's calendars or whatnot. I think I'm gonna still put them in the pouch, but I'm gonna stick it in the back. You may ask how that makes any sense. It just, you know, doesn't have to. Doesn't have to, Bishes. Doesn't have to. Um, yeah. It's a good place to see, like, a quick glance. Just turn right to it. It's so big. There you have it. Boom. I see you. Okay. Now, let's do, let's, let's do some task cards and stuff. Um, okay. I love this guy and I absolutely love how hot she is she's like super sexy right wonder what I mean that looks good on top right the only thing is what do I want underneath now I have been using marbled paper for quite some time um, I don't know if I want to use it anymore but I have this white marble I think that will be that will that looks great we'll just do that there you go <laughs> that salt problem solved this will protect the vellum and this will go here and I also made this one but I think that's too dark for what I'm going for so all right and the next thing we're going to do is I need to decide if I truly want my, I think I'm going to put my task cards here, or if I do want to make them like a, on top of this. So let's just make our task cards first, you guys. Who else makes task cards? Does anyone else? I, I'm just now like really thinking about doing it. Okay, I need to trim down about a centimeter. Um, I don't like to copy everybody, but at the same time I do. I, I like the look of it, and I need routine cards. I, I just like that reference, the reference point of view. Routine cards. That's what I really want to do. It's not task cards, but routine cards because I need morning, evening, afternoon. They change up. And then we're going to cut it about right here. Okay. I need quite a few of these. All right, so there's one, and I can round the corners too, no problem. There's one, two, okay, so one. Two. We'll start with two. And then I have actual cards. Let me show you. 
I have these too, these cards. But I like them. I like the see through thing. Okay, so let's get out. my page flags. Alright. Definitely want to use I guess different colors for each thing. So I've got charcoal. I don't think I want to use the green. I like that one. And I have a light one too. It's in my pocket planner I think. No, it's in my bag. Yeah, that one looks good too. Let's do... looks nice together don't you think okay let me get my label maker one second yo. Ow. I'm in serious trouble with my back y'all jeez please. okay Woo. I'm gonna stand up for a minute all right label maker check all right, so I need morning. Right. Cut. Morning. All caps, <laughs> I guess. Oh, jeez. Oh, I said, saw someone said, love it. Love what? Hi, love your videos. Look up on this live. Oh, thanks, M. Harrison. Stuff, love it. Okay, thanks for loving everything. You guys are great. And I'm so glad you're here, M. Harrison. You're the best. I haven't done a live or video in a long time. I did manage one last week. And I did actually film one for this week, but I didn't post it. I decided to go ahead and do a live for you guys. So, um... I just hadn't been feeling it. I don't know if anyone else gets like that from time to time, but I get like I get like that. Okay, morning. Love the swatches. Oh, thank you. I wonder how much of a lag there is between videos. Okay, I'm not even gonna bother. morning <laughs> morning okay so morning let's do light pink all right so i probably need to plan out what i want to put on these um cards because i have very different routines for all parts of my day why can't i open this what is going on here Oh, interesting. Okay. Okay. Okay, you know what? Mm -mm. Nope. Okay. <laughs> okay. Why does everyone do this? I'm having a little trouble really understanding why, but we're going to try it, you guys. Okay, so I guess in a way this helps me so I don't have to do a check-off list every day. So gratitude, prayer. And my morning routine changes during the summer. So I do a, like a light routine, cleaning routine in the morning. I'm gonna shake. Gotta do a shake. Because I swim all summer. So your girl has to stay extra healthy. Or I will not make it through the summer. Shake. Mm -hmm. And plan. Okay, it's not perfect in the middle, but I don't really care too much. Let me change. This is my baby, by the way. Let me change these size. 
Okay, no, I want small. Okay, want. We want to change the style, probably. Okay, um, font. Still need to change the. Gratitude. I love the idea of a routine card. It's not my idea. Other people have definitely done this. Now, in the past, I um, have made routine cards and routine pages just by writing them out. But people have gotten really fancy with it, so. And I, I don't know, in the past I have done page flags, but just not separate cards. More like, uh, I would do it more on like, I had, at one point I had like a whole chart <laughs> in my planner. Uh, I actually have the video up on that. It's really old though, really old. Granitude, bam, sorry, there you go. I'm not, I guess, a perfectionist by any means. And on another card, I'm going to be doing like a color code. I do have those dots, so I'm going to do that too. It's just going to take some time. I need some wine, man. Oof. I remember those videos. Oh, yeah. You've been around for a while, huh, Diana? <laughs> Girl, I went in on my videos back in the day. Um, I don't do as much craftiness that I did then. Prayer. Light tidy. All right, I went ahead and just printed out everything on one. Oh, man. Ha oh, okay. Why is this super small now? Look at how tiny it is. That's... Oh, and I noticed that this is still the same as before. The same print. Huh. Let me try it again. Why did it do this? That is so weird. Well, I want it like that. <laughs> I don't want this. Let me try and do it separate again. Because maybe... Why? This is being a pain in the ass. Now, this isn't going to work out for me. Nope. All right, let's try this one more time. Mm-mm. This is something's weird. Look. Look. That's, that's just too small. I mean, I guess, I guess I could just, I don't mind the tininess. Does it look bad being that tiny? I don't know. I'm not, I'm not about to try and change all this again. I guess I'm going to have to, but let's see. Um.
Now y'all saw what I did and everything. What happened? Like how? Th look, look, look. Why? Why? That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> what the actual f? Okay, let's try this again. What is happening? You guys, I'm freaking out. I have ghosts around here. Alright, well, there's that one. Prayer. Uh, light tidy. And I'm losing some of the ink, too. I don't like that. <sighs> I don't understand what happened. I'm not, I'm not kidding. I don't know what happened, but that's okay. All right. We're just going to keep going. Smoothie. It just looks like movie. It, it doesn't even look like smoothie. Stupid. Getting frustrated. It's not printing the S at all. I got the best option is this right here. Y'all, what do I do about this? I don't want to waste a cartilage, you know. I don't know if that will help, but we're going to try again. <laughs> Okay, I printed it out that time. Maybe I had to beat it up a little bit for it to work. <laughs> Smoothie. <laughs> okay, what's the next one? Plan. This one better work. Okay. Okay. All right. We're good, y'all. We're good. Okay. <laughs> Can y'all believe this? Okay, so for those of you just starting in the planning community or, like, really trying to make your own stuff, it takes time, y'all, and patience, which sometimes I don't have at all. And obviously these task cards are something fierce. <laughs> they take a lot of time to make. If you're doing it the way I'm doing it, I'm sure there's an easier way somewhere. But I'm not so sure. If anyone has any easier ways, I'm going to go ahead and tell you now, I am not the one to do computer stuff. Like, it's already hard enough for me. <laughs> and I don't know why I thought this was a good idea. This P didn't work out too well either, but we're just going to leave it, y'all. Prayer. <sighs> Smoothie.
smoothie. <laughs> Light tidy and plan. And it doesn't have to go in this order. You can switch it around. Um, more than likely, I won't be moving these task cards at all because I don't know. But yeah. Um, I could. They're not task cards, sorry. They're routine cards. But um, I can use them to put in my planner instead of writing it in. But. I probably will not do that. I think I'm I'm doing it more as a reminder of what I need to do. So that's why I kind of want it in the front of my planner. So we'll see how it goes down. Okay. Plan. Okay. There's my morning routine. Let's punch the corners. My husband must be watching something creepy. It's got those weird noises going on over there. Anytime it gets stuck like this, I just take my little scissors and snip it off. So y'all know what I'm doing. Okay. Number one. Morning. Dun dun dun. We got the first one in. Oh yeah. It's not as cute as I thought it'd be, but that's okay. I think I think I'm probably what I'm gonna do is actually put it in front like right here we'll see how it goes all right next task card I gotta cut out two more or just one more really afternoon I don't really have too much of an afternoon because my afternoon and evening kind of run together. But let me think, for the summer it may be a little different. I'm going ahead and cutting my corners of this card. Alright. So it's going to be this next color here. Oh, my back is hurting. Alright afternoon okay so when i'm at the pool i have those in the colored pencils oh nice susan said try powering it back on and off i literally beat it and it did fine <laughs> um yeah i'm actually really pleased with these markers they're pretty great i'm probably going to carry a couple of them with me but you know what if my planner doesn't fill up chunkify like it was I can get move into the rose one so I'm gonna keep that in mind and maybe move into the rose color now I did want to put like a notebook back here or a um a notepad because it kind of is necessary but I do have an A5 stylology I can stick in here which I've done before so that may happen today as well. So we'll see. We've got a lot to do today. All right. Next one is your afternoon, I guess. Now, I don't know. Afternoon for me would consist of the pool. So I guess this could be like pool. Yeah, pool. So um, paperwork. Um... Tidy. Phone calls. Payments. 
Oh, I just ripped this right off. Nice. Okay. Amen. Whoops. The nude ones. Thank you to a good friend. She sent me these. I've been wanting the nude ones for quite some time. Alright, so this is going to be pool, I think. Pool. Let me see all this case. Okay. And then it's going to be paperwork. Now in the mornings I set up. Um, when do you ask the words at once? It's fitting them into a certain length. Uh, I thought so, but it never has done it to me before, so I wasn't sure. Like, let's see. I just did it here. Look. So, I don't know. That is, that is the thought, though, for sure. All right. Set up paperwork. I need to do phone calls. Golly, there has to be an easier way to do this. Now I know why people charge so much money to get these done. Because it's freaking annoying. I need my tweezers. That's what I need. My tummy's hungry. I need to eat dinner. I made dinner. I just didn't eat it yet. Okay. I'm shaking. Oops. Set up. Pool. Own. like struggling I sh <laughs> few things I don't like about long nails <laughs> eh. Eh. So pool is the title Paperwork. Paperwork. Callbacks. Call okay, paperwork, callbacks, and tidying. Right. Yay. Okay, callbacks, boom, and then tidy. Oh, are you kidding me? I dropped it on the floor. <laughs> Something's not tiny. <laughs> I mean, I love lives because we can talk. 
and that you can actually see like the genuineness of a person and also when it comes to like planning or this kind of stuff you can see how long it truly takes to do this type of stuff it's not it's not a joke it takes a long time to do this kind of thing watch it in real time all right there's your next one uh, it's coming along it's coming along nicely okay so now I need to cut another piece of plastic which I just happen to have uh, I just need to cut it down properly and I'm too lazy to pull this out again so we're just gonna do what I did last time Alright. Okay. Lengthwise. Here. Okay. Alright, now I'm gonna just do this situation again and cut it this way. Boom. Alright, we got it, y'all. Alright, now we're down to the last two. Okay, so we're gonna have an evening routine and then I'm gonna have my color code. So that's gonna be fun. The color code's gonna be a lot of fun. And then I wanna show you all these little pieces. In a moment and then we're gonna try and finish setting up as much as we can um, before I get off of here but I do want to do a flip of my pocket as well so you can kind of see where it's what I'm doing where it's headed um, okay so I'm using this the Mademoiselle for evening because it's the darker my idea was that morning would be the lighter color e of afternoon which my pool job is in the middle of the day so it works out and then evening when I get home will be this dark color and then color code will have dots so there we have it okay so evening just put night no I like evening sounds better good evening just me okay evening oh let's go ahead and put okay so my evening routine consists of self-care daily review which is like notes from work to be honest oh it's sticky on the top too that's weird Daily review. Um, family time. Family time. I had to turn it over. Both sides are sticky. That's really odd. Okay. Power hour is also one. Power hour. All right. Here we go. Thanks for hanging in there with me, you guys. This is almost done. This part. I'm not as talkative as I normally am, so sorry about that, too. But, uh, just trying to focus. <laughs> okay, so. We have. Power. Hour. Self. Care. And print that out first. 
Go power hour is usually the first thing I do because when I get home, if I even sit down for a second, I'm done. So I'm trying to get home early enough in the day, at least by five, but it's not happening half the time. Power hour. Self care. Power hour. Self care. And then daily review. And family time. Ooh. Boom. You want to pour me some wine since you're up? I know. I'm almost done. But eating on camera is probably not the best choice. Thank you. I'm on a mission to finish these task cards. <laughs> okay, family. And then daily review. Yeah. <laughs> I don't care if it's crooked at this point, y'all. Huh? I'm talking to my peeps. Okay, peeps. my peeps. All right, there's your evening routine. Racha. Girl, you did it. You did it. Okay. I know. I don't see how everybody makes theirs look so perfect. I can't do it. It's so hard. Okay, wine time. I haven't really been drinking recently, but today's the day. My daughter's out in town. I'm chilling, so. Yes. Okay. Let's put my beautiful page flags aside. And I'm probably going to carry some with me too. But let me put them aside. Alright, let's get out those dots, shall we? Now, unfortunately, again, I'm going to have to still label a whole bunch of shiznit. So, uh, here we go. Let me go ahead. Uh, whew. Okay. So, my categories are work, personal, family, yeah, fam, alley, home, errands errands slash events like so let's just put events events all right boom 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 all done in one swoop Boom. Okay. Rest my label maker. Alright, so this should be fun. I haven't actually pulled these out in a while. So this is this will be kind of exciting. I don't know what the hell just dropped, but that's okay. Um, are my dot stickers? It's been a while. It's a picture my daughter drew me. <laughs> 
awesome. These are like my favorite washies. And my dog stickers are in here. There you go. Yes. Oh, and that a sexy view right there. You can't tell me. Oh, I do need to print out the color code thing. Okay, so let's do work first. It is blue. Okay, I need, I need my tweezers for this. This is gonna work. Where are my tweezers? Don't tell me I don't have tweezers. I'm gonna cry if that's the case. I know I have a couple pair somewhere. Gotta have one somewhere in here. Uh oh. What is this? Oh. Okay, I've got a pair. Okay, good. I don't want to panic. My favorite pair aren't in here, but this will do. Work. And I actually have the color dot markers, so I don't necessarily need um, the sticker so much. I mean, I like using the stickers, but um, yeah. so this will be work. Okay, that's work. Personal is purple, and it's usually it's lighter color. And then family is like a darker pink. Like this one. And then my daughter is a lighter pink, like this one or any pink really and then back in there. home is a green as this one and I do have a bunch of other color dots like a whole bunch I hadn't even opened yet so I could always change my color code but I probably won't because I've been using the same color code for years. And then errands, which are actually orange or red or events, I mean. So I don't really have an orange here. So I'm going to use this deep red color because I do like to use like a deep rusty red or orange. So, all right. And then I do like to have like a notes color, but I'm going to pass on that. It's usually like this brown here, but we're going to pass on that. So, boom. Yes. Okay. Dinner. Let's get it all together. All right. Some more cutting. My goodness. Now that I got tweezers, this may be a bit easier. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Much easier. Yep, yep, yep. Much easier. This could have been so much more easy a minute ago. Maybe not by much, but at least some. Work. Let it work, y'all. Work. Bring y'all in some more. I'm enjoying this. Oh, thanks. Okay, it says printing directly onto the page flags is such a time. I don't know how to do that. <gasps> Someone teach me how to do that. I'm too nervous to do that kind of stuff. I don't understand it. I don't get it. How? How would you do that? It's terrifying. I mean, I've heard about people printing their post notes too, and I really, really want to do these things, but I need someone to look at my printer and, like, help me figure it out, because I've got this massive, beautiful printer, but don't know how to really work it that well. I know, it sounds stupid, but I'm, I'm serious. Like, I need some assistance. Anyone want to FaceTime me and teach me how to... I want to print on post notes so badly. Ugh. I would have, like, so many cute post-it notes if someone would just... Oh, I do have something to share with y'all. I officially started my Planner Girl series drawings. Now, I can't share too much of it, but I can show you what I've been working on in a minute. Um, I'm doing a flat lay of, like, my purse. 
and all the fun stuff inside of it. So I started drawing it and I'll show it to you in a little bit. But yeah, it's going to be, well, just like the coloring book, it's going to be sold on Amazon. And you guys can go and get it. That way anyone in the world can get it. And I'm going to do die cuts. And I, I'm not smart enough to do stickers, y'all. But I'm going to do die cuts and like printables and stuff like that. So, yeah. But I'm going to offer like a, a book on stark white. It's going to be printed in color. Or you can do it as a coloring book. It's up to you. Color your own. Mm, there. Jeez, that took forever. Oh, this is much easier than the others. Sorry for the glare, y'all, but I have to be able to see. Okay, now I just need to print out the color code tab. Whew. I don't suggest doing this the way I did it. If, if you know are smart enough to do it the other way, do it that way. <laughs> For reals. But if you don't have like the funds the knowledge to do it the other way then this is always a good way to do it <laughs> big advocate of using what you have y'all okay color code oh bam oh i love it So I'm just going to let it be like see-through, right? Is that what we're doing? Just let it be like see-through. Do we like it on the front? Okay, now here's the hard stuff. Deciding <laughs> the decor of this sucker. So, I have used pretty much all of my vinyls on my pocket. and kind of wish I didn't now, but I did pretty much, especially like my little moon one. Oh my gosh. Love it. Let's see if I have any more. I don't think I do. Yeah, I may have a leopard print one or whatnot. Yeah, I've got some more vinyls. Um... Definitely use some leopard print love in here. Ooh... I don't know, I like the simplicity. Alright, so do we want to put the task cards on the front? Um, I say no. I say here, maybe? Yeah. Here's good. I think it would be too busy with this. Also, I did mention, let's see something real quick. So, let's just try this sucker in, in my, these small ass rings. <laughs> see if it's nice or not. I'll probably fill it up even more with um, stuff. But I haven't used my vintage pink yet, or vintage rose, whatever it is. Vintage pink? And I really want to try it, so.
and it looks so nice with my pocket planner so yeah so I'll actually this is not completed yet you guys this is I've got a lot I want to do still to this so it's yeah um, and I definitely need my computer and all that. And to avoid any kind of copywriting, I'm going to do it off camera. But I do want to kind of do a quick flip and maybe do some um, vinyls maybe. We'll see how this goes. Uh, I do want to show you how I plan on planning in here too. Or how I have been. Then I also want to share a couple of other things. So... Sorry, I'll... Yeah. Yeah. So I guess gold is going to be one of the colors because... Okay. Let's see what it looks like in the vintage pink, y'all. Oh, yeah. Still got plenty of room. <gasps> this vintage pink is beautiful. What happened here? Oh, yeah. I was going to put in... I'm probably going to print out some more vellums, stuff like that, so. so this doesn't go there. Well, I don't know, you guys. How do you feel about all this? I need to get these off and make my new tabs, so that's something I need to do, but, um, let's take off. Put some fresh. Tabs on here. Oh wait. There's this one. Why I... Oh my gosh. All those little pieces from the thing just fell on the floor. You guys. So. That's fun. Right? I'm going to put this one here. I like that better than the trust. Trust was my word of the year last year. So, um, I don't need it this year. This year is strength and courage. But I do like having that in there. Okay. Let's see here. I've made such a mess and I'm okay with it. I don't know if this is as floppy as the purple one because I think the smaller rings is just not as fun as the bigger ones, but it is a great deal smaller. Isn't that crazy how small these rings are compared to what I have had? So I'm probably not going to stay in this sucker. <laughs> I prefer the bigger rings um, just because I like to chunk up my planner. And I also wanted, I was also planning on putting a um, notepad back here because I need a scratch pad for like numbers and information so i do have one but it's a kiki k notepad and it's like the only one of that type and so i'm a little weird about using it but um i can always purchase find one to or purchase one but yeah i think i want to go back into my purple just because i don't want to ruin this vintage pink and 
I know y'all are probably going to get sick of me going back and forth. But I do have this one. I have the Kitty Cat one from Kiki K. I have Marbled A5 and the Cobalt Kiki K. Um, and then these two Maldens. I want the Ochre and the Malden. I'm kind of a Malden lover, y'all. But yeah. Anyway, let me close this so I can just... So basically, in my planner, I'll be carrying um, business... Well, I have been... Okay, so this is supposed to pair with this guy, okay? Um, so I have business cards in here, and I have a lot of my inbox stuff, which it's just like an on-the-go. So, I mean, truthfully, my monthly is in here. I have everything. This is a full-on working planner. So I wanted this to have more space for work, for planning out stuff, but not to carry it around with me everywhere. So that's what my plan is for this. Um, I do want to carry this, use this guy in here, because I want to use what I have first off. But secondly, um, it's a big notepad, and I think that it will work great for what I need. So I'll probably just pull off some of these there we go and then just stick it like in here um but here's the cards i'm still up in the air about all this but um so when i plan i do use my front spot spot which is like an inbox very very much I will just scribble stuff everywhere and I mostly most of the time use post-its especially in my pocket because I just that's just how I like to plan I love post-it planner girl so like I like having all kinds of information and you know and I do write as well like these are my lists and stuff um so there's that and so I still have that there so that'll be used um and then this blank paper behind my future appointments is probably going to be just like notes or daily or something like that. I do have a section similar to that, um, but it's in a form of this guy. I just scribble down notes back here and stuff like that, lists and all that. I scribble that kind of stuff there. This is also like my reference, so I don't know if I'm going to make this a daily section or what just yet i do want to have a faith section um which is super important to me so that's probably what this is going to end up being is a faith section um but anyway so like main planning in here i mean we need to fill this monthly out um maybe a sticker a day i don't know i don't know how i'm going to do this but i do know i need to print out some more of these I have one other for next month but i don't know how long i'm going to use this so I've been writing just, I just drew a line for like the days here, but I've been writing whatever I need to get done with my dot pens, um, cause I do use the color code and just putting it in out. This is a timed, um, insert. So I love having that because I like to time block and if I time block in here, I won't have to do it on my daily pages. Does that make sense? So I have... Uh, this is kind of what it looks like. I can't share too much, but the blue represents my work time here. And then my morning routine that we just kind of did up here, this guy, will actually be purple because that's like my personal stuff. So I would just do this. And if I have any appointments or anything, I'll put it in. And then evening time will more than likely be green and pink because it's with family and home house chores and things like that so um i made this like little just a clear dash here to put post-it notes um basically what's under this that i can't show i have like a pen test right here um are numbers for my swimmers that i need to call so it's super important that i have that and i needed to cover it up so that's just the simplicity I'm telling you simple and then project planning y'all saw and then of course I we did the pen test today um goes in here and then I just have a reference a series of reference notes back here I mean there's nothing special to this planner really and then a beautiful calendar here that's just for fun really and then um, I'll probably do like weather or something because I do like to weather track so I may 
do something along that lines we'll see my certification and then like I said I'll have a notepad so that's it for this evening I will be playing with this it's a little easier for me to do this kind of stuff with out the camera um it's not y'all's fault i love spending time with you it's just like i said it's just easier without the camera on to like really focus on what i'm doing so um yeah i will post the picture and then i'll do a flip on my channel when i'm finished with it completely but um yes if y'all can see my space oh my lord so i'm gonna go because mm, I'm getting tired and hungry and my back is hurting and I really want to play in my planner so I will be sure to post a flip through when I'm done so probably tomorrow or the next day so till next time thanks for joining me I'm so glad we've had a two hour fun time and see you later till next time bye